Hello chess lovers, Soren here and in this video I want to share with you a brilliant chess puzzle composed by Armenian chess composer Genrich Kasparian. This puzzle was first published in 1936 in a Soviet chess magazine Chess in the USSR. It's white to move and win the game. You can pause the video and try to find the winning line for white. Ready? Now look, at first glance it seems as though black is winning because of his far advanced A pawns and also there are two white hanging pieces. Closer examination though reveals that white rook is able to control the pawn on A2 but still everything is not so clear. Especially things become more unclear when we see this white king and white knight on the H file far away from the main events, but luckily it turns out that soon they will manage to join the party thus allowing white to win the battle. So in order to stop this a pawn, white is playing rook d1, is moving away the rook from d5 square where it was under attack and is acting against a1 queen promotion because in this case white can announce a check and can win black queen. That's why after rook d1, black is playing king b3. The black king is coming to support his pawns. Here white is announcing a check from d2, king c2 and a very important and powerful move rook a1. With this move white rook is both attacking the pawn on a2 and also after king b2 when white is playing an absolutely fantastic knight f4 move, white is luring this black king on the a1 square where it is getting imprisoned by white knights. In here all black can do is to accept the rook sacrifice after which we have knight d3. Now white knights are controlling this essential two squares and all black can do is to push forward his b pawn. Truly spectacular position, right? And meanwhile while black pawn advances towards the first rank now white king is coming near. In here we have king g3, b4, king f2, b3, king e1, b2 and knight b3 check. King b1 and king d1. A very important move. And I have to tell you that despite the fact that knight b4 looks tempting but in this case black is not forced to go for a queen promotion because after king d1 white can quickly checkmate black king. A similar position we will see in our main line. That's why after knight before black can simply go for a knight promotion and this is a draw. So after king b1 we have king d1. Here black is going for a queen promotion. In here of course already knight promotion won't work because of this knight d2 check followed by knight before checkmate. So after king d1 black is going for a queen promotion and this time we have knight b4, a powerful move with which white knight is taking under control this essential square and already the threat is knight d2 checkmate. And whatever you play, knight a2 then knight d2 checkmate is coming and if queen a2 then knight d2 check followed by knight c2 checkmate. Truly spectacular checkmate, right? Only Kasparian's brilliant mind could create such a masterpiece. Well, if, let's take a look at the puzzle solution once again, this time without any variation. So we have rook d1 and then king b3 knight d2 check and then rook a1 and after king b2 white is going for a rook sacrifice after which is playing knight d3 thus imprisoning the black king and then white king is simply coming near. A very beautiful idea in here we first have this important check and then king d1 white is allowing black to go for a queen promotion knight b4 with a checkmate to follow. Well if this puzzle was too difficult for you please take a look at this position and try to find the mating line for white. It's white to move and I will wait for your answer in the comment section. Thanks for watching, I hope that you enjoyed this brilliant puzzle. Feel free to share it with your friends as well, let them know about this beauty. I will see you in my next video. Take care.